Hi there, students. Awful, horrible, terrible, dreadful, dire, and damnable. Okay, let's look at these words. Okay, all of them mean a bad quality, yeah? The worst, bad things. Okay, so if something's awful, yeah, it really is terrible. Awful is the opposite of awesome. If something's awesome, you know the Americans always use this phrase, that's awesome. Well, awful is the opposite, yeah? Okay, it's full of awe. You get, you go, ah. Uh. Okay, awe is amazement, yeah? So it's amazingly bad, yeah? Okay, I think, notice, normally a thing is awful. Whereas a situation or something you see is horrible, yeah? Um, you can use them the other way round, obviously. Okay, so he painted a horrible picture, yeah? The food tasted horrible. The food tasted awful, yeah? We could use as well. But the restaurant was awful, yeah? The food was horrible, but the restaurant was awful. Awful's talking more about the place, yeah? Whereas horrible is talking about something more specific. Okay, terrible, yeah, really bad. Something that inspires terror, yeah. Horrible inspires horror. Terrible inspires terror. Okay, so something that's terrible, really, really, really bad. The situation was terrible, yeah. We had terrible food. So I think terrible covers both the idea of horrible, horrible situations, a horrible flavour, a horrible sight, yeah, and something that's awful in the way it's constructed, it's awful in the way it's put together. Okay, um, dreadful. Okay, dreadful is really, really bad. Again, dread is another word for fear. Um, the restaurant was dreadful, the food was dreadful, yeah? We've got that dreadful man coming to dinner tomorrow, yeah? Um, I think this word dreadful sounds a bit posh as well. It sounds a bit like uh, Henry talking. We had an absolutely dreadful meal. Okay, so dreadful. So what about dire? Okay, something that is dire is really the worst of the worst. Yeah, um, we had we had a dire experience. Yeah, the uh, performance was dire. The music was dire. Okay, um, the holiday we went on was dire. It rained all the time, and everything was expensive. Okay, I think dire is a little bit more unusual. Awful, horrible, and terrible, and maybe even dreadful, are very common. Dire is a little bit more formal, a little bit more poetic, if you like. And then this last one, damnable. Well, I think something that's damnable is something that you condemn, yeah? So the food was damnable. It doesn't sound like modern English. It sounds old-fashioned, archaic, yeah? Um, you could use it if you were being... Uh, um, sarcastic, or maybe if you're being posh, yeah? The place was absolutely dreadful and the food was damnable, yeah? But it's not a common word, yeah? You, you, could, you, could, you could use it, but I'd steer clear of it, okay? So awful, horrible, terrible and dreadful, very common use. It was dreadful. It was absolutely horrible. It was utterly terrible, yeah? Okay, so, awful, horrible, terrible, dreadful, dire, and damnable. So, I hope the explanation hasn't been too awful. I hope there haven't been too many horrible scenes. I hope I haven't made any terrible mistakes, yeah, because that might leave you dreadfully confused. And that would leave me feeling absolutely dire, yeah, because... I will have done something damnable by confusing you. Anyway, enough. If you enjoyed it, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.